Hey guys, my name is Bharat and I'm the creator of Bharat in Germany. This is the ninth episode of A Day in Life of a Student in Germany, where we show you lifestyles of students studying in different German universities. In this episode, we have Parth with us, who is a master's student at Hochschule Aalen. So, let's get started. Hello everyone, my name is Parth Parmar and I'm studying Master of Science in Polymer Technology in Hochschule Aalen. And today, I'll show you how I spent my entire day here in Germany. Because of quarantine, my schedule is a little bit fumbled up. But usually I wake up at around 8 o'clock in the morning uh, or sometimes when I have lectures at around 8 o'clock I usually wake up at around 6.30 o'clock in the morning when I take a shower then after taking a shower I have my breakfast and in breakfast I usually have like chocolate milk with two bananas or sometimes I make poha then I attend my online lectures it finishes off at around like 12 30 or 12 o'clock in the afternoon and after having my lectures done I eat my lunch I prepare my lunch or sometimes I prepare lunch and or dinner both together in order to save time after that in the evening I'll go for jog but because of the lockdown I go for a jog twice or thrice in a week. In the evening at around 8.30 o'clock or 9 o'clock, I have my dinner and I go to bed at around like 12 o'clock or 12.30 o'clock. It depends on my mood and sometimes if I play table tennis, it's more than 12.30 o'clock. I'm staying here in the dorm and I'll show you, I'll show you my room and my hostel as well. So uh, let's see. So this is my nameplate and let's go inside of my room. It's a 12 meter square room including of one big table, two chairs, a bed, a small table, a shelf where you can put your all your stuff like this and a big big cupboard where you can put your all clothes and other things. This is how my workplace looks like and yeah this is a chart of polymer materials and it is very important so whenever i need some properties or i want to know some properties of polymer i just go through it and this is a calendar where i can add some details that on what things and on which day which things i have to do so yeah and this is a map of Allen and also you can get some idea from where you can get bus and everything yeah this is my small temple you can see as I'm living on the ground floor I have kitchen on the first floor and let's go there and see how common hostel kitchen looks like So as you go upstairs, first we have common room as you can see and yeah this is the outside look from the first floor common room and later I will take you there for jogging and it's a forest and you can see the view and yeah this is a common room where we all see, uh, sit and have lunch or dinner and this is a plan or some notice where we all have to look for different kind of notices and heading towards the kitchen and on the door you can see the cleaning timetable where we all have to clean the kitchen every week on Tuesday nights this is how the kitchen looks like and every student has allotted uh, their own sections and I am from EGI so this section is belongs to me and yeah you, as you can see those are my stuff here also I have a small section here where I can put my spices pan and other stuff a similar thing is with the refrigerator and a deep freezer as you can see 
also here in the kitchen it is allotted with the number so you don't need to worry about it it's same like here as you can see h i k and l so yeah you can get all the facilities also you can get the microwave where you can put your pizza so this is a washing machine room where you can wash your clothes but you need to put two coins of 50 cents in order to wash your clothes and once you wash your clothes you can also put it in a dryer and same thing with this like you have to put two coins of 50 cents this is a table tennis room and also a small gathering or party room that's why we have so many chairs here but the only thing is you have to clean it before you leave so that it, it, it keeps clean every time when every, anyone wants to use it Right now I'm at Hochschule and we have two campuses, one is in Beethovenstrasse and the other one is in Buren. As I am studying masters here, I am studying here in Beethovenstrasse. So let's go and have a look there. Hochschule Allen is well known for their work and research field in materials. Among all the course, I choose polymer technology which focuses on the design, testing and processing aspect of the plastic components and plastic materials. So this is the campus of Beethovenstrasse. And this is a building called Ola where all the parties and assemblies are organized and in the other building this is the main building where all the lectures takes place and this is a garden where you can sit and enjoy so this is the main door from where you can go inside of the Hochschule but right now it's closed maybe yeah it's closed so i can't show you guys so extremely sorry for that right now we are going to the another campus that is in burin campus and it's there on that side This is the building of Purin campus and here all the lectures takes place where this is the building for library where all masters and bachelor students have access to buy or rent a book.
so it's evening and i'm here at the forest in front of my hostel as i have told you and it's a beautiful forest and it's a beautiful day as you can see here and let's go for a jog you can hear the noise of ringing a bell right and it's from the church and it's 7:45 pm right now and every day it rings at this time so in germany in summer sun sets at around like 9:30 or 10 pm and that's why it's still sunny and right now it's around 7:45 pm you can see the light and it's too beautiful allen also have a football team which called vfr allen and we can see here one practice football stadium and let's go ahead and check there So uh right now I'm preparing for veg biryani and have a look तो भाई आराम से उसका तो बहुत डिस्पाइट ऑफ बींग द स्मॉलेस्ट सिटी अमॉन्ग द साउथ इन जर्मनी आल इन हेज एवरीथिंग दैट एन इंडियन स्टूडेंट नीड इट हैज नॉट ओनली सुपर मार्केट लाइक अल्डी पेनी नेटो एंड काउफलैंड बट ऑल्सो हैव एशियन टूर्किस इंडियन एंड चाइनीज स्टोर्स इट हैज इट्स ओन फुटबॉल टीम नेम्ड एज वी एफ आर आल इन एंड ऑल्सो हैव अ फुटबॉल स्टेडियम ऑस्टल एरेना In addition, it has a big companies like Sice, Asahi, and Maple. And now it's time to give some suggestion and tips. And my first suggestion is you should apply for room one or two months prior coming here in Germany because if you don't do so, you can't get accommodation here in hostel. And my friend got late admission, so he couldn't get accommodation here in hostel. But he is living in Vege, and which is hundred euro more costlier than the normal hostel room. and my another suggestion is if you are planning to come here in germany make sure you will book your flight a week before your co start so that you can give yourself enough time to get adjust with the sleeping time and the jet lag i came here a week before 
and I gave myself enough time to get used to the weather condition. And finally, I would like to thank Bharat for giving me this opportunity to make a vlog and showing my lifestyle on his channel. This is my first ever vlog and I'm super super nervous and excited. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it and liked it. And for now, uh, bye bye. Ciao. Auf Wiedersehen. So this was part stay in life. It was actually really nice to see like how you can still get pretty much everything that you need in a small city like Arlen. Because I remember once making a video for my core students and telling them that, hey, like we are looking at Hochschul Compass and we are going to take a look at different kind of universities. And then the name Arlen popped up. And we were like, yeah, we have never even heard of the city. Like, I don't know uh, how like, you know, students must be living there and stuff like that. But now after seeing this video, at least like things are cleared out very nicely. And this is what I want to share. And I think we all want to see more in the future that different kind of students studying in Germany show their daily lives, share their experiences, share their stories or any kind of tips they have for us. Because that is the way we can make the most of the Bharat and German YouTube channel. We have such a big audience and if we have the audience there already, like there's nothing stopping us from providing massive amounts of value to them. I already have this whiteboard and on this whiteboard you have so many names. Let me just show you real quick. So next episode is going to be Abhinav and then we have other students who are planning a day in life series. So the series is going to go on for quite a while and I'm actually super excited for it. If you want to get featured in the series, write me an email at parat at paratandgermany.com and I'll get back to you. Thanks a lot for watching the video again and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.